Hey guys, Newbies Haggard here. Currently on my mage. Uh, he's level 39, job level 46. Uh, today we're going to do some vertical firewalling at the Orc Field map. Um, so I'll go into detail of um, vertical firewalling as I walk through the map. So I'll teleport around. So vertical firewall is laying a firewall in such a way that um, it's basically lining up three firewalls in one, the three sections. So when these monsters are approaching from the northeast like that, I lay a firewall to the east side of me and it'll hit them um, and make them walk through three sections of firewall. Um, so like when they're coming from that direction, it can lay in a horizontal pattern to the south of me. Um, so you got to be careful which way they're walking. Uh, you don't want to improperly place it. So all the monsters have to be coming from the same direction in order to lay, lay it effectively. Um, so since we got this mob coming from the southwest, um, I can actually throw it over here and then walk north and it should kill them all. And then even if I stay in that line of path, I can get that orc warrior. Uh, most of the way down, oh, we're going to get this mob. Uh, okay, let's try and get all of them. Alright, I'm going to lay it to the west side of me. And another one as well, and I'll fireball this guy. And that should take care of most of them. Let's grab him. And I could... As you can see, I'm still utilizing that same firewall. Um, <clears throat> so as long as that's standing, I'm going to try and use it. So there we go. Worked out into our favor. Uh, did gain another level there. I'll try and get this orc baby. As you can see, his mob kind of walked around. Uh, so they're not going to be in my firewall, but they will definitely die once uh, the work baby dies. Um, so another proof of concept. There's another big mob. Walking from the west, I'm going to go a little north of me. And that whole mob should... Ooh, almost got the whole thing. Um... So since he's on my line of sight, I could actually go up two cells and he will get stuck in the vertical firewall. So as you guys can see, I'm just using the vertical firewall um, majority of the only skill that I'm using here. Except for um, those one-offs when the monsters are not in my firewall, I'll fireball them because I do have a fen. Uh, and I do have good defense with a cranial uh, guard. So you want to see my gear. <clears throat> Currently using the arc wand that gives you maximum HP, HP plus uh, 387. Uh, so I don't want to die when something hits me. Uh, that's why I went with that. It also has a undead enemy plus 23%. Uh, that'll help on later. As you can see, I didn't place the firewall correctly there. But that didn't matter because it wasn't a big mob. Uh, this will definitely help later on at, um, you know, stings or GH, prison, uh, definitely need to learn that vi vertical firewall, um, to get, be, be effective in those maps. So, um, I'm going to try and find a big mob, here we go. Proof of concept again. I want to lay it here. And there. There's some more. If you've seen what I did there, I um, laid a firewall directly on my body because the line in which they were walking was in that path. Let's 
definitely leveling in here has its benefits with the amount of monsters that are running around. I'll let that one off to the left of me hit me just for the benefit of getting that mob. And maybe I'll lay in here and walk over here. Pretty close to wizard at this point. I'm definitely going job 50. Highly recommend that you go job 50 with all your characters. Um, so you get the most out of your skills. As well as um, stat points, bonuses. Almost out of my HEs. Okay. I do not have any more, but wow, what is this? It's a huge mob. Absolutely huge. I gotta run. Okay. Um <laughs> I'm gonna try and kill this mob. Wow. Absolute wow. Oh my god. Definitely struggling to get this gigantic mob. Oh my. What the heck? Uh, there is so many. Ah, I can't do it. <laughs> I will definitely try to go back there. Okay, we're back. Um let's uh, Wow. Alright, let's see here. Come on. Alright, got a lot of them there. Oof, oh my. Oop. Ah. Starting to lag up a little bit. Let's try and get back over there. Alright, so it's right there. Do a little buff here. So here's the massive army. I actually can't lay more than three firewalls, so... Um. Ooh. Getting a little sloppy, but that's alright. We got most of them. Okay. Just like that, I'm two job levels away from being a wizard. Uh, going on to the rest of my gear, I have an immune muffler, a rager card um, that's going to give 20% reduction from neutral property attacks. Uh, so definitely that paired with their cranial guard and the, the max HP allowed me to survive those situations with uh, those large mobs even though some of them were attacking me. Um, if I didn't have that gear I would probably be dying like two hits. So I definitely like to get my gear in advance before I start a character. Um, it's just so much easier to level that way. You know, if it's your first character, you obviously you can't do that. But um, if this is your second, third, fourth, you know, or 20th character, 
I highly advise getting gear in advance. Um, so that it's just a smoother transition when you're leveling. Um, it didn't take that much time at all to create this character. Uh, and bring him to the level that he is. Just based on the gear that I have. Um, definitely going to start working on an archer. I'll probably make a video from uh, novice straight through to um, the archer class and probably as far as I can go uh, until the video is over. I uh, already have the gear for that. I didn't actually make the char character yet. If you guys seen my previous videos, I do have a rogue. I think he's like 86 or 87 right now. Um, he definitely needs an arrow crafter, which my hunter is going to be for him. Uh, it's getting kind of expensive buying um, arrows from other players when I can just start crafting them myself. So that's an interesting take on the vertical fire. I got two <clears throat> simultaneous ones, and now I'm going to get the mob to go through this and should kill them all. It's going to be close. And we just got it in time. And like I said, um, I will definitely get my gear in advance. And if you heard from my previous video with my rogue, uh, that gear is going to be for my archer. Uh, so they can interchange. That's why I picked the gear I did. It could be used at pretty much any level. Uh, as long as you're not a novice, I believe. So I'm working on getting a weapon um, strictly for my novices to help them get to jo uh, love job 10 as fast as possible. Uh, you know, something with high attack, maybe some Andre card, Andrew cards, uh, Zipper Bear cards. Not sure what I'm going with yet. Just so that they could one hit monsters and level up just that much faster. firewalls will that be enough yes it will just gonna straight up firebolt this guy oh no going full melee on this guy and we got him <laughs> I do have a Vitata card as well for heal. Go to champion, soul enchanted shoes, and all lucky number seven. Could go higher, but I like the way the sevens look. <laughs> Could raise my stats. Yes, I can. Going all in right now. Um, probably Dex Vit later on in the game. I want to get his Mac Mac attack as much as possible. Not quite sure where I want to go with this yet. <clears throat> I'll definitely let you guys know later on. As you can see, I barely even touch my skill tree. Um, I'll play around with it later once I actually have to figure that out pretty quickly because I'm approaching job 50. 
Um, so, I gotta get on that. <laughs> Typically, I make something um, like having all the bolts at least level 5. Um, just so that I can pass the wizard test easier. I probably will do the wizard test um, here on video. If you guys want to see that, let me know. Uh, thank you for the comments before. Um, definitely took your suggestions on raising the mic volume. Let me know if it worked out. I just threw that firewall for no reason. Um, let me know how you like this one. Maybe if you want to see my rogue more or different characters, um, definitely let me know in the comments. I will typically be playing every character at some point. Um, definitely like this game a lot. Used to play it a long time ago. I do have an IRO account still. Renewal. Not sure if I'm going to start posting more of that. I kind of like Transcendence and the way it's going so far. So I might stick primarily with this. But who knows? I'm working on some crazy builds on Iro. Working on my Shadow Chaser. He is going to be like a crazy casting monster. Shadow Caster. Okay, I just got handed that mob. I'll take it. Oof. And as you can see, I am getting hit a lot. Um, I could try to avoid it more, but it really doesn't hurt all that much as you can see so I'm not too worried about it uh -oh. <laughs> probably cut this video around 20 minutes Fairly close to be next level. Next job I need. <clears throat> I don't know why I find that amusing. Hitting stuff with my arc wand. There's really no point in making that plus seven. I just wanted it to match. Do, do, do. Arc wand. Attack. Got about one more minute left. Almost job 49. Almost level 42. Uh, definitely take that one for them. And this way. Like that. Arc wand attack. So thank you guys very much for watching. I uh, look forward to any suggestions that you guys want. Anything you want to see, let me know in the comments. And thank you guys very much again. And have a nice day. Thanks.